Hello students. Today we will try to understand different types of inverters. So, what is inverter? An inverter is a device that converts DC power into AC power at desired output voltage and frequency. The inverter circuits can be classified into many groups based on the basis of different criteria. First one is according to the type of load or based on the number of output phases. We know that there are two types of AC power, single phase and three phase. Therefore, there are two types of load, single phase and three phase load. And according to that, there are two types of inverters, single phase inverter and three phase inverter. If the load is single phase, single phase inverter is used to run the load. There are two types of single phase inverter, half bridge and full bridge. In half bridge inverter, two thyristors and two feedback diodes are used. In full bridge inverter, four thyristors and four feedback diodes are used. Generally, three phase AC supply is used in industries and the load is three phase. Therefore, three phase inverters are used to run the load. These are again classified into two 120 degree mode of conduction and 180 degree mode of conduction. In 120 degree mode of conduction, the conduction time of all the thyristors is 120 degree. Similarly, in 180 degree mode of conduction, the conduction time for all thyristors is 180 degree. Next is, based on the method of commutation, inverters are classified into self-commutated inverter and forced commutated inverter. Self-commutated inverter does not require additional commutation circuitry. So, this reduces the complexity and cost of self-commutated inverter circuits. Example, inverters using GTOs and transistors as switches. X is forced commutated inverter. In forced commutated inverter require additional commutation circuitry. Example, inverters using thyristors as switches. Next is based on the connections of thyristors and the commutating elements. Inverters are classified into three series inverters, parallel inverters and bridge type inverters. In case of series inverters, the commutating components are connected in series with the load. In parallel inverters, commutating components are connected in parallel with the load. Next classification is based on the output waveform. First one is square wave inverter. Second one is modified sine wave inverter. And third one is sine wave inverter. In square wave inverter, the output waveform is a square wave. Modified sine wave inverter is also known as quasi wave inverter. This inverter generates the signal near to the sine wave. Sine wave inverter generates pure sine wave. Next is based on the nature of DC source feeding the inverter. Inverters are classified into Voltage source inverter VSI and current source inverter CSI. If the input DC is a voltage source, the inverter is called a voltage source inverter. If the input to the circuit is current source, then the inverter is called a current source inverter. Thank you.